All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how to import your goals from Google Analytics 4 into your Google Ads account. So if you have not already set up a Google Analytics 4 account and actually made conversions in the Google Analytics account, you're going to need to do that first before you can actually import them into the Google Ads account. So if you haven't done that, go to the description below, click on the link to my video, which shows you exactly how to set up Google Analytics 4 and the conversions within it. And then once you've done that, come back to this video and do what I'm going to show you here. So what you're going to need to do is log in to Google Analytics, obviously into the account that you want to link to the Google Ads account and you need to sign into your Google Ads account as well. So I'm just going to go into my Google Ads account. And so once you're in the Google Analytics account, what you're first going to need to do is link your Google Analytics account to the Google Ads account. So I'm going to show you how to do that here. Hey guys, real quick, if you run a service company and you'd like to add at least 100 to $300,000 per year in new business guaranteed or you don't pay, just hit the link below to book a call with us and we'll show you exactly how we'll do that for you. Back to the video. So you want to go to tools and settings and then go here under setup to linked accounts. So now it's going to open up this page, which is going to allow you to select all the different services that you can link your account to. So see right now I've got the old Google Analytics, uh, Universal Analytics link, but I don't have GA4. So you need to go here where it says GA4 and Firebase and hit details. And then you want to go down the list and select the account that you want to actually link it to. So make sure it's the correct one. Okay. And then once you've found the one that you want to link from the list, you just want to hit link here. So now it's going to ask you to do all this. I typically just allow it to do everything it needs to do. So that way there's no issues with data and just hit, uh, hit link. And so now it's going to say project successfully linked. And now under linked accounts, when you go back to linked accounts, you should now see it here. So now you're going to be able to import the conversions into your Google ads account. So how you do that is you go tools and settings conversions. And in here, you want to hit new conversion action and import, and then select Google analytics for, and then web, assuming that you're doing a website not an app and then hit continue. Now, an important note I want to make here is that if you have just linked your account, it might not show all the goals here yet to import. It might say there are no goals to import and you'll have to wait a couple of hours and just come back and do it. So if the blank, if the screen is blank, don't worry about it. Just come back later in the day at worst case scenario tomorrow. And by tomorrow it will show up Google and uh, the conversions. I've never had it not show up after 24 hours. So if it's not showing up, then there's another issue. So just know that if, if it doesn't show up immediately, don't panic, come back later and it will. And then you just select the ones that you want to import, hit import and continue. And now you've imported them. So now you just hit done and you go back to conversions here and you should now see them in this list. So if we scroll down the list here, you'll see GA4, you see these ones. So the call booked email click and phone number click that I made. Now, what's an important to note here is that these are now listed as secondary, which means that uh, they're not going to be used for optimizing your campaigns. They're just used to count the conversions here under conversions. So what you want to do is you'll need to switch these from if you are running previous Google Analytics, uh, Universal Analytics goals here, you're going to need to switch them. If you're doing this in the future with a new Google Ads, uh, Google Analytics 4 account, after universal analytics has been shut off, then you don't need to worry about this. But if you're, you have been running universal analytics goals, you're going to have to go into these ones and you're going to have to go into them just by clicking on them and set them as primary so that once the switch over happens at the end of June in 2023, you don't lose the data. So what you'll do is you'll go edit settings and then you want to go to goal and action optimization and you want to set it as primary action. So you would just set primary action, which I'm going to do, and then just hit save and then done. And you want to do that for the other two as well. And let's just keep that last step in mind. That's important to make sure that it's actually going to use the new GA4 goals to, to actually optimize your ad account for them. So that's it. That's all you need to do. And then once you've done this, you've added them all as primary action, 
you hit save, um, then your account should now show, start showing them up in the conversions tab and it should optimize for these. So just keep an eye on it for the next couple of days, make sure that it's actually working, make sure that they're actually showing up here, it's counting the conversions and it's showing them in your campaign. But other than that, that's the whole process, that's all you should need to do and now your GA4 conversions are in your Google Analytics account. Catch you on the next one.